quite lucky with my studio. I know it doesn't look very tidy or it looks, you know, there's, there's quite a lot of stuff going on in it, but it's a very calm environment. But there is a feeling in here that this is my space and this is where I get to create whatever it is I'm doing um, without any interruption. Woodlands are something that um, I resonate with hugely. Um, I'm very lucky living just outside Henley because obviously I'm surrounded by beautiful woodlands uh, which are fantastic throughout all the seasons and I don't need to look very far for inspiration. My name's Sarah Pye um, and I consider myself to be a contemporary impressionist. So I paint mainly nature-based themes, woodlands, the sea, wildflower meadows, but mainly by dropping the paint onto the canvas, which is a little bit different. Some people say it looks like pointillist work because there are lots of small round dots, um, but mine aren't placed on the canvas, they're all dropped from a height. And the compositions are built up with many, many layers of droplets of paint um, until they form the final scene. I love trees generally, but there's something about strength and growth and being grounded. There's the trunk which is strong and carries everything and then you've got the canopy um, which changes you know, daily in the seasons really. So you know you go from the winter frosts and the skeleton feeling of trees in the greys and the blacks and you know, hints of mauves and, and then when the spring comes you've got that vivid lime green where in the beech woods just around the corner from where I live um, the sun comes through the new leaves and they're almost iridescent you know it's a fantastic it's a fantastic scene but in the last year I've really appreciated um, the value of them I suppose just on the way they can affect our lives um, in its simplest form painting's complete um, it always sits in my studio for probably a week or two afterwards um, quite often on the easel where I walk past it daily I look at it daily and I get the feeling of the painting myself and sometimes I think a piece is complete and then three days later I'll look at it and I'll go I don't know it definitely needs some more light over there or I need a little bit more contrast in the front or you know those bluebells just aren't quite vibrant enough and I will go back to it and add another layer or two layers on. And people say to me sometimes, oh you know, oh, your paintings make me smile and I go, great, job done. It would be wonderful if one day people looked at a painting and were able to go, oh we recognise that unusual technique, you know, that's a Sarah Pye painting.